28 days left before my hardcore Iron Man fight against Framed. I got two RX legs in the last episode and now I have 70 defense after one day here at the Ammonite Crabs. I got carried away, 70 attack. It's now time to push towards the chivalry and the piety prayers. These are gonna be essential to win my fight against Framed. Look at this quest boss, can't even hit through my Torex legs. And that Shiloh village completed. Here we go, one small favor completed. We get two XP lamps right here. Straight to prayer, that is 53 prayer, and that is 54 prayer. Man, I started the one small favor quest with 140 strange fruits for my energy, and now I'm down to nine left. And that's another quest completed, holy grail, and 55 prayer. King Ransom a huge quest to complete. We have almost unlocked the chivalry now. We do get an antique lab. I didn't know about this. 5k prayer experience. That's really nice. For some reason I still haven't completed the lost city quest. So we're gonna do that really quickly for the dragon dagger upgrade. And I think the dragon dagger is gonna come in handy for the final fight against framed. That's lost city completed. Dragon dagger upgrade. Very very nice. The nice training ground. The only way I die is if I disconnect. So I brought myself the escape crystal just in case. And there it is, 80k experience in 4 skills. I just love this prayer method, 56 prayer, and we keep going. 57, 58 prayer. I completed the quest in search of knowledge for 10k prayer experience and that's 59. Another grubby key, do we get anything? Nothing. When me and Frame started this challenge, we decided to cap our build at 75 defense and I decided to get that real quick, 75. No more defense. Back to strength for all the future experience in melee. I only have like two weeks left to grind this account and I honestly don't know if I'll reach 70 prayer for piety but we did get 60 for chivalry which gives me 20% defense bonus, 18% strength and 15% attack so that's gonna come in handy for melee. Time for the next grind, fire making, we start with 25, we need 50 for winter Todd, and from winter Todd we need magic logs for desert treasure, so here we go. And it's done, 50 fire making, um, I think I'm just gonna open them up one by one, maybe can get some warm clothing, use that instead, uh, sadly nothing from the first one. What, do we get any magic logs? No magic logs, we just got the warm gloves and that's it. Another crate, nothing, and there we go, 1000 total level. All right, magic logs. We got two Tome of Fire. Oh, what? That is a huge upgrade on the account, but what am I gonna do with two of them? I can turn in one for burnt pages, right? Oh, that's actually so nice. This item is actually gonna be great for the final fight against frame, plus eight magic attack and defense bonus. With this massive reward, I think I can celebrate with some food and what's not better than something healthy and delicious and today's video sponsor, HelloFresh. HelloFresh are offering 16 free meals today where you can pick food based on what you want. Chicken, meat, burgers, vegan, they have it all. So whether you're trying to save money, eat better or stress less, HelloFresh is here to help you do all three. No more staring blankly at the fridge wondering what to make for dinner. Give HelloFresh a try and choose from over 30 calorie smart or protein smart recipes each week. And to top it off, they are giving all new subscribers free dessert for life. That means you will enjoy a totally free dessert item with every single HelloFresh delivery. And now that's important. So get yourself 16 free meals plus free dessert for life from America's number one meal kit by scanning the QR code on screen or clicking the link in the description. Use code CENGINEER 16 fm at checkout. Give me magic logs! Okay, I brew my torch. 10k points, do we get magic logs here? Nope. My fire making just climbing right now, 72 currently, still no magic logs. No magic logs, still. We got the hood though. I got this hard clue scroll and to complete it, I need to do in search of Merrick. Oh my, we got our first hard casket on this account. We want black D hide or a magic short bow. That's what we are going for. Black DI, magic short, but we got them both. We got them both, nice upgrade. Magic short boy is gonna increase our DPS range training so, so much. Sarah Page 4 as well, that's huge. That's absolutely amazing for the account. The magic short boy is so good is that you can just play LMS, trade Justine, get rune arrows, 
and boom, we got ammunition for range. My friend here says I can't get 300,000 subscribers. Let's prove him wrong. 13,750 points in this supply crate. You see, I can't even open this because I need 28 spaces, so I need to bank everything. I'm so depressed. I don't want to go back into the cave. Another crate? Nothing. I didn't even think about these two upgrades. Archer's Helm, Range and Magic Helm, a true Swedish Viking. Another crate? Nothing. I got sick of fire making. We got 70, so now I'm just AFKing range. And that should be... Hold it. There we go, 70 range. Upgrade to the black DI body, look at it. It's so nice. I can't believe you're still going for magic logs. My third day in this Discord and you're still going for <laughs> magic logs. All right, I'm sick of this plate. We got eight fire making. If I don't get the magic logs now, I'm doing another quest. Yeah, we didn't get any magic logs. Yeah, I'm doing something else. I, I can't be here anymore. I'm gonna need 56 agility for a major upgrade on the account. We start at 40. 100 laps later, 45 agility, we keep going. Uh, 256 laps later, 50 agility, we got 78 marks of grace. All right, we got the graceful hood and the cape. Gonna save a lot of run energy running around on this account uh, for the future. So many hours later, 56 agility. How many laps is that? 185 in Falador and like 300 at Canifis. Okay, it's time to do some questing. We start with Regicide. Finally, I can do this quest. And a few hours later, that should be Regicide completed. Just one quest left now, and that's Roving Elves. This should be Roving Elves completed for the quest reward of a, either a crystal bow or a crystal shield. The crystal shield is what I'm going for for the final hour, but I want the bow right now for a fire cape. So we're picking the bow. Crystal bow unlocked. Fire cape time. This will be our gear. Blighted Manta Rays and Blighted Super Stores. I don't have Prey Potions, so we'll have to do this in a PvP world so we can use these Blighted stuff. And I think it should be fine, no one normally camps this spot besides Scout Bots, so we'll just send it like this. We got the Torx legs as well as Tank legs. Alright, here's the Jet Kill. Come on, just one more hit. Just one more hit. Is that the kill? There it is. Fire cape completed. Look at this bad boy. We got the fire cape. Beautiful. And we're still in a PvP world, so we should probably hop from here. We have completed the easy combat achievements as well. Give us the antique lamp. We're putting it on. I think I'm going Herblore this time. 5k experience to Herblore, 29 Herblore. Fire cape achieved for plus 4 melee strength and a lot of defense. I'm considering using this for the final fight against Framed, but we could also consider the magic cape. I haven't decided yet. You know what? I don't even care that I'm wasting all my rune arrows because I just want to flex my fire cape no matter where I go. And there's our requirement for Desert Treasure, Troll Stronghold completed. And that's the final requirement for Desert Treasure 1 completed. Temple of Ikov, as you can see right here, we got every requirement completed for Desert Treasure 1. But, we still don't have 12 magic logs. Another crate? Nothing. Right, another crate. Still no magic logs. I gave up at Winter Todd. I'm just so burnt on doing Winter Todd 80 fire making. So, the thing is, I got both the Staff of Air and a Tome of Fire. So I don't have to use any runes. I can just use the runes I got from Barrels. Another crate? Nothing. Every woodcutting level for me is very important because it increases the chances of getting magic logs. And that was 55 woodcutting. Another crate? Nothing. 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 Another Tome of Fire, are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding? Stop giving me Tome of Fires. I just want magic logs. Uh, I mean, I guess I'll just give me the pages. At what point did I just give up? Honestly, I can't be here forever. Like my stats are just not growing at all. While Kevin's, they grow every single day for some reason. I think this is like day seven or something at Winter Todd. What do we get? Nothing. Okay, I can't do any more Winter Todd. I'm so burnt. I'm here at Barrels. Give me something to make me feel better. And you as a viewer can also make me feel better by giving the video a like. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, oh my god. We got a good in Shane's body. I like that. 30 kill count. I'm, I'm, I don't even need Jangberries anymore for Barrels. My day got better. My day actually got better. After all this Winter Todd grinding, I'm happy now.
Back at Winter Todd, please! Nothing, nothing, nothing. Uh, nothing. Another max point crate. Open it. Still no magic logs. Oh my god! No, I'm so sad. Please, just look at my loot tracker right here. We got 235 mahogany logs, teak logs, yule logs, maple logs, willow logs, oak logs, but no magic logs. It's just painful. It's so painful and depressing. I feel like I'm getting so far behind with the grind, so I'm just training magic, killing fire giants on Slayer task. Because we do have a chance of getting a brimstone key. If we get a brimstone key, we have a 1 in 30 chance of getting the magic logs, and that will speed up everything. Surely I can't get more unlucky on brimstone keys compared to Winter Todd, right? Right? Okay, um, we got a hard casket from the Hellhounds. We still got two brimstone keys. Black D high chat or any god D high? 3, 2, 1, good luck. Nothing. I'm gonna build myself a portal chamber in my house. 100k spent. We're gonna make a portal to the battlefront. So now I can just simply come here to Conor Mountain very, very quickly with the battlefront teleport. Brimstone chest, here we go. Magic locks, magic locks, magic locks. Pure essence. Rune plate legs. Another brimstone key. Rubies. Sad. Rune plate legs. Rune plate legs again. I'm not even gonna bother anymore. I'm just gonna open. Yeah. Four types of logs. Nothing. Every time I get a fire making level here, I suffer. And that's 89. Please. Nothing. No logs. <sighs> Another crate. Nothing. No magic logs. 90 fire making another depressing level. The level just keeps going up and we still don't have magic logs. Nothing. It's so painful seeing all these logs I've gotten from Winter Todd. Um, please someone, yes. And my misery. Oh, nothing. Actually depressed. 91 fire making, the suffering continues. I recently got 75 magic on the account, meaning I can use fire wave. Good XP. What would have been even better XP would be to burst and barrage these jellies. My first ever superior monster, like the dream is an imbued heart, but I can't expect to get one. Nope, nothing. Alright, please, we got four brimstone keys, four chances of getting magic logs. Dragon arrow tips, room plate bodies, coal, and swordfish. I got a four step clue scroll right here, maybe a casket, so we're risking it. Not a casket. Alright, step number six, casket. Black D high chaps, upgrade! That's nice! That's really nice! Three hard clue scrolls, black dehyde chaps, body, and magic short bow. Two more brimstone keys, please, 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 please. Rune plate legs. Rune item. Oh. Alright, I've given in 60 wood cutting. Uh, I think I'm just gonna get the level at this point. It's been over 10 days of grinding winter talk, grinding brimstone keys, grinding everything for magic logs. Where do I buy this rune axe? Is it here? All right, give the rune axe. I think I'm just gonna go chop teaks. I think teaks are the quickest. Why didn't I do this earlier? 65 wood cutting only took me a few hours. Why did I waste weeks doing winter thought? Why? Why? Someone tell me. I don't think you realize how satisfying this is. 71 wood cutting, four levels away from magic logs. But I believe we can boost up and shop magic logs using brown spice. Yes, there it is. Our first magic log. 11 left. We got one magic log with the boost. All right, 72 wood cutting. Now let's go get ourselves the magic logs. One more magic log and we're done. Come on, please. Let this boost last, please. There it is. 12 magic logs. I am so happy. I'm so relieved. It's actually done. Now with the magic logs, I can finally start and complete Desert Treasure 1, a quest that's essential for the future of this account and winning the final fight. And within the first part of this quest, the magic logs are gone. Oh my god, the last lockpick, and <laughs> we got the Gilded Cross. Thank god for this little rat save spot. It protected me 
and we got the Shadow Diamond. Only Ice Diamond left, and thankfully I got the Gomol's Hill, so I can just teleport up here. Very quick transportation method. I've collected all the diamonds, we've made it to Azandra, and this should be the Desert Treasure 1 completed. You don't realize how nice this final is to finally complete this quest. Ah, oh, it's so nice. We can use Ancients finally. Get out of here, Leo. The first clip of me doing Wintertown going for the magic logs was 19 days ago. Can you believe that? 19 days in the making to complete this quest. And I end up just woodcutting for the magic logs. And now we have less than 10 days left for the final fight for the hot crime and status. And I got some tricks up my sleeve. So subscribe so you don't miss out. Also, I haven't watched Frames videos. Do you guys think I'm ahead or am I losing right now?